The Young and the Restless is celebrating 50 years as a staple in many homes across the country with the 50th season kicking off this week here on WSA 9. So before we bring in two of the show stars, let's go down memory lane with a look at one of their first scenes together. Rationalize all you want. You should have waited for Victor to get back before you took this to the board. Why? So we can cut the mustache a break? When was the last time the mustache cut your family a break? Have you forgotten what happened to Jabot? What happened to Dad? Hell, you of all people should know that turnaround is fair this play. It's a turnaround. It's revenge. I think I've made it pretty clear where I'm coming from. This is business. Oh, it's so intense. Here they are today. Welcome in Peter Bergman and Eileen Davidson. What's it like looking back at that first clip you guys did together? Nothing has changed. I'm still yelling at him. It's crazy. <laughs> Nothing has changed. Exactly. That's the thing. You still really bug me, Pete. Yeah, you annoy me too. <laughs> Hopefully just on camera, right? What's it like off camera? I know you all gathered, what, on Friday night to celebrate the 50th anniversary? It's fantastic. Yes, it's fantastic. Uh, lots of actors from the past, lots of faces we hadn't seen in 20, 30 years. Uh, it was pretty great. It what? was. It was fantastic. I, I brought my husband and we had a blast. It was so much fun to see all those different people. I mean, some I didn't even know. And that mm -hmm. photo, I don't know if you guys saw it. We took this big photo on the steps with all these past and present, which was really, really fantastic. Well, everybody, ha you have such a special bond, whether you know them or not, because you're such a part of this iconic show. What do you think it is, Eileen, about Y&R that has kept it on the air for 50 years, that makes it a beloved, mm -hmm. you know, favorite for everybody? Iconic. Well, I think a lot of it is, is you know, sentimentality. You know, the show's been on for a long time, and a lot of people were raised with our faces on their TV screens. And, you know, we remind them of home, and, you know, we keep bringing in the drama. And um, we're all having a lot of fun doing it, so I hope everybody is still hanging in there and having fun watching yeah. us. Peter, this week you're starting some special anniversary episodes, right? What can people expect? I don't know how you get the drama any higher than it already is. Uh, it will get higher. Really? We, we, start, we, we start on Thursday. It is the bicentennial celebration of uh, of the founding of Genoa City, and uh, and everyone is coming from far and near to celebrate. And some people that we don't need there uh, show up and trouble. <laughs> and people that we don't need there. Don't need there. They were not it's invited. <laughs> That's a good way to put that. I love it. I remember yeah. like staying at home at, when I was sick and I'd watch yes. you know, the soap operas in the morning. Just like such great memories. And Eileen, you originated Ashley Abbott. You beat out what? More than 100, 100. candidates for this role? Wait, listen, I don't I don't know that. That's a fact, but I'll take your word for it. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> I do remember that I, I lost one of my contact lenses the day I had to screen test for it. So I was doing it with half my vision. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe that was a good omen. I was say maybe yeah. added a little more to the, to the drama. Maybe. There you yes. go. Yes. Meanwhile, Peter, I read that you actually have some roots here in D.C. Did you graduate from Crossland Senior High School in Camps Run, Maryland? I graduated Maryland? from Crossland High School in Camps oh. Run, Maryland. What? Uh, I won't say when. Um, <laughs> yeah, uh, I, I have wonderful memories of Washington, D.C. I love the city. Do you get back for reunions or, or like class reunions with your high school? I, I haven't been back in a little while, but uh, but yeah, I have these crazy memories. I used to skip school and give people tours of Washington, D.C. We started with the Botanical Gardens. We'd go to the National Gallery, and then we'd go to our representative to get passes to watch the Senate in session. That's what we that's what, what? we do with it. With, with the morning and then I'd get caught of course and get in trouble. <laughs> How could you get in trouble for doing that? I know. Yeah, that's, it, it, it kind of that's helps also. <laughs> Sounds very educational really. <laughs> Your teacher should have been yeah, proud of you I for was, that one. I was, I was in the gallery when they voted in the 18 year old right to vote. I was wow. there. Oh that's very cool. And I should have been in school. Wow. No, I'm glad you skipped. Yeah, oh, that's yeah. better. You got a much yeah. better experience Absolutely. there. Absolutely. Well, Peter, Eileen, congratulations. Yes. Enjoy this week of celebrations. <laughs> but thank you so much for taking time with us this morning. Thank My pleasure. You. And don't forget the 50th yes. anniversary celebration episodes of The Young and the Restless kicks off this Thursday at 12:30 p.m. right here on WUSA 9.